If you've been on the internet any time within the last few months, you may have noticed a lot of talk from companies about the use of AI in their products. Programs like ChatGPT have taken the world by storm with their amazing capability to do pretty much anything you want. Now joining the party is Roblox, with what they call Generative AI. In this video, I'll be going over exactly what this is, including how it has already been implemented into the platform, and what the future of development may look like. So first off, what is AI? For those unaware, AI stands for artificial intelligence, which is basically the act of a machine, being either a computer, a robot, etc., simulating the actions and knowledge of a human. AIs can perceive, synthesize, and infer information by gathering from sources all around the internet. Now, how is this AI technology being used on Roblox? Well, this past week, Roblox released a few new features into beta within Roblox Studio that demonstrate the use of AI. The Material Manager, code completion, and advanced search in the creator marketplace. Let's go over each of these new features. Automatic code completion is the first of the three newly released AI power technologies on Roblox. With this feature, developers can start typing a line of code in Studio, and the AI will attempt to autocomplete the remaining line or lines of code based on what it thinks you are trying to accomplish, or by looking at previous code already written. This feature will help make scripting easier than ever for both new and existing developers that may not have an advanced knowledge about scripting or Lua. Now before you enable this feature, you will be asked to agree to some terms and conditions that state that you will not misuse the tool, and clearly states that the model is trained on no private developer data and only uses public marketplace assets to learn. Right now, the automatic code completion tool is in beta, meaning you will have to enable it to use it. To do so, open Studio, head to File, beta features and then look for the AI powered code completion feature and check the box next to it. Then click save and restart studio. To learn more about this tool, check the link in the description of this video. The second of the three newly released AI power technologies on Roblox is the material generator. The material generator is basically an image generator that allows you to type in a query and watch it generate a material you can use on parts or terrain. For example, you can type in something simple like blue cobblestone with yellow grout and receive some textures that resemble that query very well. Or you could type in something crazy like a head of lettuce with a blue pencil sticking through it and still receive some textures that resemble that query. No matter how you use it or what you type into it, this new tool will provide a way to generate new, never before seen materials within Roblox experiences. When applying one of these generated materials, you must first apply it to a base material from the list of default Roblox materials. Then you can adjust the pattern and size, which in this case is studs per tile. Right now, the material generator tool is in beta, meaning you will have to enable it to use it. To do so, open Studio, head to File, Beta Features, and look for the Material Generator feature and check the box next to it. Then click Save and Restart Studio. To learn more about this tool, check the link in the description of this video. The third and final newly released AI power technology in Roblox is a more advanced search system in the creator marketplace. With this update, you can search for more advanced queries and get more precise results for exactly what you are looking for. For example, typing in brick house with smoke coming out the chimney into models will bring up a bunch of models that match that search, even if some or none of those words are in the actual name of the model itself. The AI scans through what's in the models and thumbnails to show accurate results. This feature is live right now in testing and can be used either in the toolbox, in studio, or the creator marketplace on web. To learn more about this tool, check the link in the description of this video. With the growth of artificial intelligence on a rapid increase, it's safe to say that the future of creation on Roblox will be heavily powered by AI tools and programs to make the process simple and more streamlined for both new and existing developers alike. I don't expect Roblox to stop here with the release of more AI-powered features, so keep an eye out for what's next. Now, let's hear your thoughts. How do you think AI will power the future of creation on the Roblox platform? What do you think of these newly released features I mentioned in this video, and what other AI-powered features do you hope to see released on Roblox in the future? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. But that is going to conclude it for this Bloxy News video. If you found it helpful or useful, be sure to leave a like. And if you'd like to stay up to date with the latest and the greatest Roblox news, please subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss a thing.
Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.